see if we can catch some of these bridge fish real quick. Oh yeah, look at all the crappie on that set right there. That's what we're looking for. spawner these uh these bridges are really good for this time of year yeah because that fish has not spawned out yet isn't that something yeah that's what i was trying to figure out if, uh, what was going on with the, the fish you know as far as here is just really making me miss some fish. That East Texas uh, fungus, though. Let him go. Got that one on the fall. That's a good eater. Good eater. Throw him in the live well real quick. Definitely some fish out here on this bridge, so don't overlook a bridge, you know, in the spring. April especially. They will get all over a bridge right now. And this rig right here is double jig rig. Two 16th ounce jigs with a loop knot. It, uh, it's hard to beat. Palestine's got some beautiful crappie in it. Oh, one hit it on the fall. So funny how they do that. It's like a reaction bite. Ooh, there's some right here though. Right here, I think. Yep. Thought I saw one there. It's a decent one. Decent black crappie. That's a, he's a keeper. I'm gonna let him go though.
Nice white crappie on that camo's custom head tie. Beautiful fish, man. Yeah, on that camo's custom hand tie. Y'all be sure to check him out. He'll be linked down in the description as always. Makes great hand tie jigs. Y'all be sure to support him. And another one. Keeper black crappie there. It's a perfect eating size. Beautiful. Some of my buddies are gonna be mad at me throwing these fish back, but I, uh, I'm gonna keep like five or ten and fry them up tonight back at back at camp. So it's on, it's pretty early, and I don't want to be having them in there the whole day. So All right, we got a few right here. Again, we'll see if we can get them to bite. enjoyed that i know it's a little noisy but that's how bridges are but as you can see bridges are super productive um it's not even really the prime time for them to be on them i mean they're they're always on some fish on bridges but usually like may or so june when these fish get, get done spawning <laughs> for me is usually the best <coughs> excuse me so it's gonna get there but you can catch a limit off of this if you really work at it you know just take your time just pick you know two or three fish off each column and there's a whole bridge so you'll you'll have a limit no problem but today this double jig rig right here i just got 16 pounds black and chartreuse jig up top and uh pink and chartreuse um camo joe's custom hand tie look at that sweet looking jig caught some good fish uh probably about 12 to probably 16 18 inches apart that double jig rig gives you two depth zones especially somewhere like a bridge where you know you're not going to get hung up it, you can't beat it in my opinion so really hope y'all enjoyed that you know lake palestine i have not fished out here when i did fish out here i did fish the bridge um, one time and uh caught a few but didn't do too good it's in the middle of the winter so this is way before live scope and everything but yeah this really helps being able to, to see what i'm doing and you can do this without live scope just because i use it doesn't mean you have to you know just know where the cross members are and up and be below and above them and where those fish really hang so y'all be sure to comment if you have any questions hit the, thumb, hit the thumbs up if you can that really helps me out and subscribe if you haven't bell that way every time I post a video you gotta get you guys get notified thanks again for all the support we'll catch you in the next one y'all take it easy